is up it is your boy will back with another video today and in this video i'll be talking about blackberry stock ticker symbol bb okay so i'm gonna give you guys some bb stock analysts one main buying level that i see if price drops okay i said a big if because it can continue going but it is down a little bit after hours so if price drops there's a key buying level i'll see where i'll buy more shares okay if you're in the discord group we did buy shares today um, I can't remember what time we bought shares. Uh, let me look real quick for you guys and see what time we bought these shares. Oh, make sure you guys smash the like button, subscribe, and also turn your post notifications so you don't miss any updates. Let's try to get this video over 40 likes. I really appreciate it, okay? So we bought shares today at 8.33 a.m. So literally three minutes after market open, we bought shares. So within this candle, because it's a 30 minutes, so every candle says 30 minutes, we bought right here. Okay, that's why I said you guys want to be in my signals alerts because I try to give you the best signals possible for options and shares. Okay, this is where we bought and look where it ended up. Okay, huge return today. I am still holding. Okay, I am still holding. Blackberry has just started kind of in my eyes. And I do think we can see price go very high. Okay. So you want to make sure you're my signals alerts. It's on my website. That's the first link in the description. Go to the website, scroll down, and then you'll see the uh, buy and sell alerts for options and signals. Okay. We got in right here today. Now, key levels you want to be looking at. Now, as I told you guys, if you guys want to live stream, I was looking for price to go above 18 to around 20. Okay. It is not there yet. So I'm still holding. Now, with the longer term shares, I will be holding until price goes over 30. But in between, I will be scalping in between. Okay, so my money can work multiple times. Now, the levels that I see so far, uh, let me zoom out a little bit. Okay, so the levels that I see so far, first I'll give you guys a resistance level. And that is around 1720, okay? This is the first uh, resistance level that I see. And if you guys want to know how I get these levels, um, I did create a stock market uh, crash course for you guys to kind of help you maneuver through these markets, okay? And I'll be uploading uh, continuously on there, okay? Just one time fee. Now, first level right here, let's make this, I don't know why it's thin. Okay, so first resistance level that I see, again, price is around 15. So when it gets up here, we might see some selling pressure and I'll just buy more shares after that sell off, okay? But that's the first level around 17.20 for a uh, resistance. Now, let's zoom in. Buying level is around 12, let's see, 12.09, I'll say 12.10 right here. This is a level that I'll be looking to buy more shares at, okay, if it comes down. Okay, it does look a little bit down after hours. Okay, but again, pre-market and after hours, sometimes they don't um, very they don't present well of what would happen in a normal uh, market. Okay, so first buying level around twelve dollars and ten cents. Okay, these are really the only this is right here is the only buying level that I'm looking to buy for more long-term shares if it comes down tomorrow. So if it's a down day tomorrow, I'll be buying here. Okay, very simple. If it's an up day tomorrow, I'll be looking at that resistance level around $17.20 for a sell off to buy more. Okay, so very simple, very key levels, and it helps you better trade through these markets when you know what levels you should be looking for. Okay, and also in between, I will probably scalp it in between while holding the longer shares. Okay, so I'll be holding with you guys, I'll be holding the longer shares, but I'll also be scalping in between. OK, so if you want to know what I'm scalping in between, you can get those signals on our website. OK, it should be on the front page. When you scroll down, you'll see the signals. OK, for options and shares, I send signals almost every day, but we do not have to trade every day to be a profitable trader. OK, always remember that. Now, I hope you guys like the video. Um, always remember, not a recommendation to buy or sell anything. This is for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in these videos. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.